Hi, I'm Ed Lloyd from LloydMesita.com and who is LloydMesita.com? Today, the date is 6.24 in the evening time right now. This is October. No, I mean, today the date is October 24, 2015. Time right now is 6.24 in the evening. Now, um, all right, I happened to get uh, this email or rather message from a friend of mine. I wouldn't say a friend, just a young man. Uh, who speaks to me. He's 21 years old and he has decided to actually get married. The reason why he wants to get married is because he apparently wants to save this young girl from her difficult life that she has and he has a soft corner for her. So he spoke to me and asked me like, um, what do you think? I, I, I really want to get married to this girl. And um, well, I, I did tell him that, uh, listen, uh, it's not the age to get married, take it easy. So he's like, no, my parents have agreed and all. So I was like, okay, if your parents have agreed, well, what can I say? But I would suggest and highly recommend you don't get married. Then um, the following day, he called me in the evening and he was crying over the phone. And I asked him what happened. And he was crying and sobbing. So I, I just asked him to relax. I told him, relax, take a deep breath, drink some water, wash your face, have a bath. When you're relaxed, Give me a call and we can talk. And once he was relaxed, he called me and he stated that uh, his father, his parents and him were having uh, many disagreements because uh, they didn't want him to get married to this girl and uh, he wanted to marry this girl. And uh, then I was like, uh, I thought you told me that uh, your parents didn't want you to get married to this girl, uh, did want you. And now you're saying they don't want you. So obviously he missed out or skipped a few details. And it seems apparently his parents didn't want him to get married and he was insisting on getting married. So now, uh, this video is for those people who are planning to get married or who are planning to settle down, and especially who are young. Um, you know, this was my conversation with him. The first thing I asked him is, uh, do you have money? He said, no. Do you have a bank account? He said, no. Do you have a stable job? He said, no. Do you have uh, friends who can loan you, let's say, 50 or 100,000 bucks uh, without asking you back? He said, no. Do you have anybody who can take care of you apart from your parents? I said, no. Then I asked him the same question about the girl. He said, no. So obviously, I think common sense, he shouldn't get married at all. In fact, I even told him this, that um, your only job right now is to have fun and enjoy life. Just enjoy, do whatever it takes to have fun, safe fun, don't, don't cross the limits. Um, and make sure that you, uh, you keep yourself happy all the while because uh, the biggest mistake you can do is enter into a commitment. Now, people have this fascination that marriage is something romantic, sweet, where you kiss each other, hug each other, have romance all the while. No, marriage is a responsibility, something that becomes routine. The love that is there is shown through the work that is involved in the marriage, whether it, it can be as simple as uh, doing housework every single day or uh, ensuring that you're working hard for your partner or for a common goal, even though you're not passionate about it. Or it can even be as doing things for your partner without expecting anything in return. So this is marriage and it's by no means related to kissing, hugging, romance, that love which is shown in uh, movies as, you know, the songs that are being played and the music in the air. No. So I did tell him that um, he shouldn't get. So he asked me, what should I do with the girl? I said, just dump her, block her, get rid of her because she is nothing but a liability. So he was still not convinced. And then I told him, okay, very simple. Uh, do you think, do you seriously think she would get married to you? Had you been old? Had you been just working as, let's say, a laborer, having basic minimum wage where you can't even support yourself, where you have to suffer, uh, let's say, where you have a disease and she has to look after you for the rest of her life, would she still marry you then? And he said, no, he wouldn't. And then I asked him if she was, let's say, uneducated, unattractive, really down in the dumps and uh, uh, where you have to take care of her for the rest of your life without any amazing romance, would you? He said, no, honestly and truthfully. So, um, you know, I, I think uh, he understood what I was trying to imply. And uh, the following day, I think within 24 hours, I think he got out of love because he learned one important thing, you should love yourself and nobody else. So this was my experience and this is my advice to anybody who's young, who's thinking of getting married, don't. Because marriage is not romantic, marriage is not about having babies, marriage in today's day and age, marriage is a very complicated and uh, 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 
a tiresome process whereby you have to really sacrifice, you really have to give. Involves a lot of responsibilities and a hell lot of priorities. So uh, unless you have found the perfect partner where you wouldn't want any other girl in your life, any other, and you don't even feel any other girl is attractive, uh, whereby even if she did look, let's say, fat, ugly, and um, she lost all her beauty, you still find that sense of joy of being with that person, then you should get married. However, to tell you honestly, uh, the choices that we make when we are young always changes when we grow old or rather wiser. So this is Lloyd from LloydMasida.com and it was Lloyd sharing with you his views on getting married at a young and early age, which is an absolute no-no. If you have any views, let me know. Love to hear from you. Goodbye for now.